it's been a little over a month since I started uh, working on some weight loss with intermittent fasting. I've been running for a little bit while before that. I really saw some real results after a month. I've lost 22 pounds over the last uh, 32 days, uh, and I really am feeling some serious lifestyle change going on. Uh, but let's go back to see where I started one month ago. All right. Sorry to do this to you, but I am going to try to lose some weight, so I figured I had to take some before and after videos. Um, here is what we've got going on. Um, yeah, not pretty. Let's make that look better. What do you say? Time for initial weigh-in. 236.8. I've been running a bunch lately, uh, trying to do 31 miles in the month of August, and haven't really been worried about my diet or anything like that, just because I've been trying to stay focused on running, and I'm doing pretty good. I really feel like I'm going to accomplish that. I'm about to actually go run my first 5K ever right now, and since I haven't been doing much nutrition stuff, I'm going to get started. Uh, I'm going to dial it in a little bit tighter, but I'm going to start with some intermittent fasting because I kind of eat like that anyways. It seems like a great place to start. And uh, I'm going to try to increase my exercise as well by running more. And hopefully I don't burn myself out by doing too much at once. But I've been running for a month now, uh, so I feel like it's not too much of a transition. August in Texas, it was crazy hot, so I'm ready to go. Time to do this thing. No more excuses. Uh, kind of crazy that I'm about to start running 5K. Uh, but it's go time. I, I did this. Let's make it happen. I did it. 5K is in the books. 41 minutes, 55 seconds. Uh, pretty pleased with that. Uh, 3.2 miles and uh, First time ever to run more than three. Can't believe that only four or five weeks ago I was uh, barely barely running a mile. Uh, it really piles on quick, and I'm 236 pounds as of today. So if I can do it, anyone can. I'm sure of it. See you soon. Now, uh, one of my secrets to motivational success for uh, going on a long run in the hot day is uh, puppy cuddles. Oh gosh. Yes, I missed you too, boys. Oh, yeah. Mm. <laughs> hey, uh, so I've done the running thing. Now I'm losing weight, trying to focus on the diet. Uh, Got to take some days off from running occasionally, so I figured I would start doing yoga. I've never done yoga uh, since I was a kid, but I'm going to try. And that's been pretty much the last month. I've been working on getting my 5K down. I'm down to right around 38 and a half minutes now, which is a couple minutes of improvement already. I'm excited to continue that. I am going to continue to try to lose some weight uh, and keep the diet tight. I uh, am still losing weight almost every single day. Uh, I'm noticing kind of half pound shifts uh, all the time and uh, as long as I'm able to keep seeing progress I'm certainly going to keep staying motivated and uh, keeping with my hours. I have spent uh, a handful of days where I've eaten my fasting window or my feeding window down to uh, sometimes as few as four hours with 20 hours of fasting. Uh, just Really, I'm trying to eat my 1,800 calories of good vegetables, minding my macros and make sure that I'm eating the right things. Uh, I've been taking a multivitamin, uh, that on it total human. I've been feeling really good about that. And uh, I'm just pumped about the way that life's going right now. And uh, my mood, my vibe, uh, just everything is better. Every single aspect of my life. I can honestly say is better. Um, so, without further ado, I'll show you guys where I'm at. I think it's pretty obvious that I've lost some weight. Um, my clothes certainly aren't fitting right. I've had to go and get uh, my uh, suit and tuxes refitted for some weddings because my sister's getting married. 
uh, and I'm excited. I'm, I'm adjusting my clothes because this is how I want to live my life now. Uh, and I'm confident that I can do it. Uh, cool thing about intermittent fasting is you can kind of turn it on and turn it off. I went to Cuba for a week and I was fishing all day on a boat and uh, I just couldn't start my day without getting some food, going out and being in the sun for, uh, you know, 10 hours in a row. So I spent a week without doing intermittent fasting too strictly. I just was careful with my uh, calorie consumption and what I was eating and I was continuing to lose weight. Uh, I still do think intermittent fasting has been my key to success in cutting out um, cutting out the snacking, but also learning how to be hungry. Since I'm in intermittent fasting every day, I'm making being hungry for an hour or two a part of my daily routine, and I'm learning how to handle it, uh, and I'm actually being energized by it, because I can feel that that's when my progress is being made, uh, when I'm telling my body, hey guys, it's time to turn off food eating. Uh, we can resume that tomorrow, and we'll get back to it. Um, and it just has made things a lot easier with staying motivated and friendly and happy to everybody around me. So maybe it's good for you, maybe it's not. There's diets for everybody. Uh, that's the, another great thing about intermittent fasting is you can make it keto, you can make it vegan, you can make it whatever you're into. Uh, I kind of didn't do any of those things. I, I just have uh, cut some things out of my diet and made sure that I'm putting the right things in. Uh, and trying to diversify my fiber and eat as many different vegetables all the time as I can. Uh, and obviously supplementing that with a lot of meat so that I'm staying nice and full. Um, so yeah, that's uh, been the last month of my life and I'm excited to keep everybody updated as things progress. So uh, get out there, I hope things are going well. Subscribe to the channel if you like this. I'm certainly gonna have more updates uh, and I hope you're making some positive change in your life. And uh, let me know if you think there's some things that I could maybe be trying uh, to add some awesomeness into my life. I'd love to hear it. So drop that in the comments and uh, maybe I can give it a shot for a month.